I'm Greg Sherman with Vibe San Antonio with the season preview for the 3A Carn City Batters. I'm joined by Kira Robinson. Kira, you all got knocked out in the second round by Marion last year. I know it's great to make the playoffs. Everybody wants to always try to make another round farther. Just a thought on getting to the second round and trying to get back, trying to get on to round three and getting eventually to see. Um, just gotta have harder practices, work harder. Fortunately, I got injured, so that kind of threw things off a little, but the team really stepped it up and uh, worked hard whenever I got back, but this didn't work out for us, but this year we're back and all healthy, so hopefully things work better. One of the things people maybe don't know is how good the athletics, especially the girls' athletics down Highway 181 is. We've talked about both at length with their volleyball success. Fall City, girls basketball having a lot of success along with Carmen City. Maybe tell us a little bit about the girls athletics down 181, those, some of those cities and those schools that we don't get to see up here in San Antonio as much. Uh, it's definitely very competitive. Uh, Poth is a big rival. It's always a huge game. Stands field. Uh, it just makes you want to work harder. It's a small town, but it's really trying. <laughs> Well, Kiera, appreciate the time, and hopefully the uh, injury will heal and we'll get to see you at full strength this year. It's, it's Kiera Robinson from Carn City, the Badgers in Class 3A. I'm Greg Sherman for Vibe San Antonio.